Another meaning of corruption, though, and, and, and also an important one, is a process of degeneration. When something becomes corrupted, when, when the rules that are supposed to hold an institution or an entity together uh, themselves uh, no longer uphold uh, any kind of rational purpose. So we can think of corruption as describing both the, tr both the transgression of established rules and the process by, uh, of degeneration uh, whereby the actions of those in power, even when they conform formally uh, to established rules, uh, nonetheless are clearly contrary uh, to any rational purpose, and in particular are, are uh, contrary to uh, the pursuit of the common good. And it's very interesting to, to, to hear the exchanges that have happened about Mark Carney's role in government uh, during question period. Conservatives have critiqued the fact that liberals have, have tried to find a way around the rules by making Mark Carney an economic advisor to the Liberal Party without nominally, officially having a role within the uh, kind of executive exercise of power of the Government of Canada. So, so Liberals think they've come up with something very clever to kind of skirt around the rules. They say, okay, well, he's not an advisor within the government, he's an advisor to the Liberal Party of Canada. Well, well um, most Canadians are aware of the fact, even if they don't like this fact, but the Liberal Party of Canada is in government. Th this is clearly an effort to skirt the rules to protect the interests of elite insiders, to allow Mark Carney to continue to get the advantages of his business position while also having close access to government and being able to use that access to advocate for policies which may benefit his private interests without any kind of proper disclosure or transparency. So this may not be corruption in one sense of the word, but I think it demonstrates a corruption in another sense of the word, which is the degeneration of respect for the common good in the exercise of public functions by the government. <laughs>